welcome back to new exercise for beginners so this is your 3d model now all dimensions are in millimeter material steel polish now look we are going to start with bottom cylindrical face see the outer diameter 60 and the length is 60 millimeter okay the hole we will make at the end now let's make this upper part this upper part you will see the diameter 60 millimeter and center to center distance 105 millimeter you will see this circular face and this vertical face are tangent to each other that's why this length this is considered from the center of this face and here you will see two options 20 millimeter this depth and 10 millimeter this depth so total 30 millimeter and it is going to start from center so let's do this now first you have to choose any plane so i am going to select right plane a sketch now activate circle now move cursor over origin point click from left mouse and drag see right click select and out of the sketch activate the smart dimension now this diameter 60 millimeter now look now this is fully defined sketch see at right bottom now finish sketch activate extruded boss base feature now here starting condition we will keep same direction one end condition i am going to select mid plane so that this is going to move in both side now here distance 60 millimeter say ok perfect now which plane front plane because front plane at the center of this a sketch now I am going to select line and start from any one end from center to center and ok see the line is created if i am going back to the line and again i am moving cursor see the line converted into arc just draw a half nearly half click and move to end point and close geometry see this is close activate smart dimension by default radius 30 and distance from here to origin point make sure 105 now look drawing is fully defined but bef better to create a full circle here ok extrude now at the bottom you will see selected control just move cursor over any of this so first I am going to select this one now start condition same end condition we will make reverse we want back side and this thickness 20 millimeter look according to drawing say ok now again select the sketch 2 and activate again extruded boss base now again this time go to selected contour and move cursor over circle and select only circle now starting condition we will keep same from and end condition we will make two two direction now in one direction keep end condition blind and according to drawing this is 10 millimeter here activate direction 2 see and this is going to be 20 millimeter now look here see the preview say ok and see now there is one step radius 60 30 there is a hole and depth is 15 millimeter and this distance from center line center of this circular solid 60 millimeter 25 this one then there is a one rib this rib 12 millimeter if you calculate this dimension this is just located at the center of body 24 here 12 here if you subtract from 60 24 you will get other side it means this is at the center of this now let's create one plane now select top plane top plane is just mid of this drop down reference geometry plane now one is selected and here put dimension 60 millimeter see say yes now select plane one a sketch 
ओके वी वॉन्ट टू क्रिएट बैक साइड ओके एक्टिवेट लाइन टूल नाउ अगेन ड्रॉ गो बैक टू द पॉइंट एंड सी द लाइन कन्वर्टेड इन टू आर्क क्लिक कनेक्ट फ्रॉम हियर इवन दो यू कैन सेलेक्ट द लाइन एंड सेलेक्ट हियर कन्वर्ट एंटिटीज एंड सी द क्लोज प्रोफाइल क्रिएटेड नाउ क्लिक ऑन द लाइन एंड यू विल सी दिस ऑप्शन मेक वर्टिकल अगेन सेलेक्ट दिस पॉइंट एंड अगेन यू विल सी दिस ऑप्शन टेंजेंट दैट्स फाइन स्मार्ट डायमेंशन सेलेक्ट द डिस्टेंस फ्रॉम हियर टू हियर इट्स ट्वेंटी फाइव मिलीमीटर एंड बाई डिफॉल्ट दिस इज गोइंग टू बी थर्टी बिकॉज दिस ऑल लेंथ इज सिक्सटी मिलीमीटर नाउ लेट्स चेक आइसोमेट्रिक व्यू एक्स टू नाउ इन दिस कंडीशन वी कैन एड सर्कल ऑल्सो सो जस्ट अगेन चेक नॉर्मल एड सर्कल and define this radius diameter 30 mm now finish sketch isometric view extrude now see only close profile selected now here start condition same end condition moving towards up 15 mm make sure you selected merge if you unselect it it's become second body see right click on plane and you will see this option hide see select this face a sketch activate circle tool draw one circle at center smart dimension and define this 44 mm now this is fully defined sketch now simply exit and activate here extruded cut feature now by default selected by system because there is only one close profile start condition we will keep same end condition we will keep blind and here oh, even though you can select all through all yes see the hole is created even though you can hole created with the help of hole wizard here one option hole metric and here i am select drill size either you can find the distance from a uh, size or you, if you don't find just simply choose show custom and here make 30 see here select up to next next means the back side face position now select this face now move cursor over and you will find midpoint see this plus mark it is midpoint click and press escape key to out now see preview here we go front plane right plane sketch now here i want to create a rib so simply select line select this end point something here okay now select this uh, hold shift key select this circular edge and this rib and create relation tangent rib now just check direction this is moving opposite direction flip material we want to move towards body now even though you will see thickness i want to add in both side not in one side and how much thickness 12 mm simply say yes and here we go even though you can add material edit material and you can add material from here also apply material asi 1020 apply close now see even though appearance you can apply from here also go to appearance metal steel and from you can apply here so this is how we did a simple exercise for beginners i hope you like it don't forget to share like our video and please subscribe our channel 
for more video and more projects in solidworks thanks for watching